You know, Joan, you and I have been on television together an awful lot together over the years, and I just wonder whether you believe what you said a minute ago. Do you believe you know this guy Beck enough to make that accusation that he's really charged by racism himself or that Rush Limbaugh is? You know, I really... You really can, believe you yes, think I you do. know their motives you know, I, enough I was, to say would, that? Yes, I do. I really do. I'm sorry, Chris, because I think that words have consequences, and I think that if you... I judge people not only by their words, but what, but, but, but what they do. And if you look at people who have a pattern, who built a career out of dividing people, and who built a career out of often, not just Obama, but finding ways to degrade and diminish African Americans and African American leaders, I don't, I don't care what's in their hearts, to be honest honest with you, they can tell themselves they're not racist. They can tell me they have black friends. I don't care. It's racist to consistently make your living on the backs of black people. And, and you know, you brought up 400 years, and th let's consider this an intellectual show where we can talk history. I truly believe that this assault on Obama is linked to what you referred to earlier with his health care numbers dropping. And I will tell you why. In the 230-year history of this country, the reason we have never developed a social democratic base the way they have in Europe. We're the only Western country without some kind of universal health care, Chris. There's a reason, and it is because corporate interests have divided the American people by race and ethnicity, the Irish from the blacks, the Germans from the German Jews. It goes back to the 1700s. It's been very smart. It's been very effective, and people have voted against their self-interest to keep some other group down, and therefore we don't have the basic things that other countries take for granted in terms of, of a social infrastructure. That that's what they're doing again. They want to defeat health care. They want to defeat his whole agenda by dividing us on racial lines. I don't think it's going to work. I really don't. But that's Do you what's believe happening. This